Thank you, Ryan. Well, there's still time to get on board with a job over at UISD before the new school year begins. They're hosting another job fair this week, and David Canales is here once again joining us with all the details for that. Good morning, David. Thank Good you morning. for joining thank, us. Thank you for having so, me. We're still a few weeks away from the start of the school year, so there's still time, and you're still recruiting for the new school year. Yes, we're always recruiting year-round. <laughs> So tell us what positions are open. What are you all looking for? So we are planning to have a paraprofessional auxiliary job fair this Thursday, 3.30 to 6.30 at United South 9th grade campus. Mm -hmm. uh, we're hoping to interview bus drivers, custodians, teacher aides, uh, lifeguards, mm -hmm. uh, you name it, every position, facility workers, uh, anything that has to do with para and auxiliaries. Okay, and mm -hmm. I was just going to ask you to define paraprofessionals for our viewers. Specifically, what are paraprofessionals? So our paraprofessionals are people like uh, our teacher aides, mm -hmm. our, our clerks, our office clerks, mm -hmm. our auxiliaries, our support staff, uh, the cafeteria workers, uh, including custodians, bus drivers, uh, mm -hmm. facility workers, things like that. And Typically, these folks, what kind of educational background would they have? For the auxiliaries, uh, you don't need a high school diploma. You just have to have some good references, mm -hmm. uh, pass you know, the normal background checks and everything else that goes with it, and uh, you come in like that. Our teacher aides, uh, they have to be SBEC certified, so they have to have at least 48 hours of credit hours of uh, college, mm -hmm. uh, or we can pack them, which is where you become a substitute, you do so many hours, and then a, a principal can vouch for you that you can do well as a, as a substitute, as, as a teacher aide as well. Right. So because of those guidelines and the criteria, there's a lot of opportunities for folks out there who are looking for a job. And working for a school district definitely has some fantastic benefits. Yes. Uh, matter of fact, uh, the Silver Radio voted us as the best place to work. Yay. And... Uh, <laughs> And of course, you know, we, we're like a little small little city within a community. We have all types of jobs. A lot of people think that it's the schools, it's just teachers. Mm -hmm. But no, we have electricians, plumbers, carpenters, uh, HVAC. Uh, we have, of course, our teacher aides, our, our swimming pool, lifeguards, and mm -hmm. things like that. I mean, we need everybody. I mean, every school needs uh, yeah. staff like this, to be honest with you. Are you all opening up new schools this year, or are you on a... Uh, for this school year. Uh, the following year, we'll be opening up one of our new middle schools. Next year. Yes, and mm -hmm. then, of course, the uh, reconstruction of Clark Elementary will be opening up next year as well. Mm -hmm. uh, so that staff will move over, but we will have to definitely fill uh, Ramita's uh, middle school, for yeah, sure. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. You were talking about Clark Middle. That's the school that we see going up right there, Clark Elementary, the one that we see going up right there by the mall. Right behind the mall. Yeah. You know, wow. right behind Clark Middle and right next to the fence near yeah. the mall, that's the new uh, Clark Elementary. Wow, interesting. Yeah. That's going to be pretty neat there. So um, let's talk a little bit more about the job fair. It's taking place this Thursday. You said it's at the ninth grade campus yes. um, in the south. What are yes. the hours for that and what do folks need to take with them? Uh, hopefully they have already applied online, but if okay. not, you know, can they still go? Bring your resume. Uh, definitely, uh, if you have reference forms with you, mm -hmm. please bring those along with uh, with us. If you know what, if if you want to get ahead, you can always visit our office, 301 Lindenwood. Mm -hmm. uh, we are more than happy to help you. It's from 3:30 to 6:30, United South Ninth Grade Campus. Uh, all the principals will be there for the teacher aid positions, uh, and also they'll be there to looking for custodians. Of course, we'll have our auxiliary staff that'll be looking for cafeteria workers, drivers. Uh, our custodians, our bus drivers, our bus monitors, our mechanics, and everybody else. Sounds good. Thanks a lot, David. We appreciate having you with us. So yes. everybody head on out there. If you're still looking for a job, great place to work, UISD. I can vouch for that. I worked for UISD before. Thank so you. Yes. it's a good place to work. Yes. Stay with us. We'll be right back.